What's up lads and lasses and welcome to today's quick 10 tips and tricks video which I could think of on the top of my head but yeah maybe I can make some more in the future. Anyways let's get right into it. At number one I'd advise to choose the generals which suit your playstyle. So I'm a player who likes to do a lot of damage, I'm an attacker so I choose the uh, generals which are typically very attacking like Carl or Washington which do loads of damage in the battle ability but Carl's is a, a support unit which I like next to my attacking units and yeah just choose what you like if you're more defensive player then maybe you choose the defensive generals but this game doesn't really reward them but I mean whatever suits your playstyle uh, also in this game it is very much so that quality goes over quantity at least the generals instead of having a lot of, uh, let's say, medium rank generals like these generals rather save a bit up for the top generals because you do get enough medals to get good generals. You see, I've got four gold generals and even one purple one. And yeah, go for quality. Don't necessarily get the blue and green generals only because they're cheap. Get the best generals. My second tip is uh, militia usually do wonders defending cities. Militia is really well for defending city because they already have a base like I mean I already have upgraded my militia It's like 108 or so and usually the enemies can't do as much attack So even if it's almost around the city, if it was by militia, they won't capture a city in that round So if you have a unit next to a, a City and it still has full health try attack it by water because then you do the cam the cannon damage Which you can see here which has more damage to defense unit and armored units and then it does more damage to the defense. But if there's unit in there, then it's not so advisable because it could uh, he attacks you with a higher bonus. Next is you should choose the right country to grind, which means you should choose uh, if you want to get a lot of medals and gold to get your generals up and to get your tech up. Choose the right countries. For example, Netherlands in 1798 is very good. Generally, this conquest is very useful because there is not such a huge map. It doesn't go as long. You can do a a uh, conquest in about 15 minutes if you do it right, or maybe 20. Next, uh, you should encircle enemies with structures of units, which you could. Uh, a quick example would be. I'm gonna build it up here. This kind of structure here, where in every single tile of these four units, five tiles, everybody will be encircled. Mostly, grenadiers are the very best unit. Because they're there for attacking cities and in conquest what you have to do, you have to attack cities, it's not about killing units. Also most campaigns and in challenges, grenadiers you know, with, with militia are the two unit types I use the most. They're the most useful, except in maybe unit killing missions where you have to kill like enemy generals, then elite infantry and uh, assault infantry can be very useful. But otherwise, gra grab grenadiers. The next tip is you should focus your technology where you need it. So I use a lot of infantry, so what I do, I upgrade my infantry. I don't waste my training or my uh, technology in, let's say, structures like these here. It's not very useful to me. I don't use it a lot, so focus where you need it to get the maximum gain. A next tip is look at your shop. Shop is located uh, in the item store here on the right where there is a very useful items sometimes. For example, you can get battlefield med packs and stuff where you can get health for your generals. I've already bought uh, two ambulances which give 30 HP per round, which is super useful for your generals, especially if you want to have a long-lived general like my beast generals like Carl and Washington both have an ambulance. It makes a lot of sense to buy the best uh, attacking item of a, of a class. For example, the Ferguson rifle is the best infantry increasing item super useful another tip is do the 50 percent missions if you can do it you can get the generals 50 percent off and you get medals and gold super useful and yeah sometimes they're quite hard sometimes you have to wait a bit till you can grind up but generally they're quite useful and you can get really good generals like lunas you can get for 800 medals which i did myself uh, my final tip is do upgrade your generals it is so useful for example i upgraded uh carl's infantry master to level six so he gives 20 infantry attack and then you have 3 grinds and I got his jungle fighting up to 25% when he's fighting in jungle so I use my generals where they're useful I put them in the jungle like Carl and near other units and also really urgently upgrade his rank if you have a high general upgrade him to M general because then you still get one slot more 
and the title upgrade always because it's just it's just gold it's not even medals so it's super useful to get that up and as you can see you can create a real beast general here i hope you enjoyed my quick tips and tricks video thank you so much for watching please subscribe i do appreciate it there's still over 90 percent of people who watch my videos who are not subscribed would appreciate if you guys would drop us up and have a great day. Bye.